beach and this is a memorial combat medic memorial first infantry division so this gives you a really good idea of what they faced coming in landing at this beach Now this beach is clear. There would have been obstacles, barbed wire, concrete ob tank obstacles, tetrahedrons. There would have been all kinds of stuff here. So this is what the men of the first division coming ashore here. And further down, the men of the 29th division. This is what they would have seen coming off those landing craft. A big, wide, expanse of beach to cross, and they came in at low tide, so that the beach, a lot of the beach obstacles would be exposed, and the, the landing craft navigators could steer around them. So that meant they had a lot more beach to beach to cover. This reminds me very much of that scene in Private Ryan, where they're coming off the landing craft and you, there's a machine gun up on the hill mowing down the guys as they come off the landing craft kind of that where that monument to the uh, engineers is up there so you can see the remain where the bunkers are the remains of the bunkers are up up in those hills there's probably one over there and all along that ridge that's a lot of beach to cover this is a big wide beach. Big difference between this and the ones at uh, Bernier sur Mer and Col and, and uh, Saint Aubin sur Mer and Courcelles sur Mer. This was a defender's paradise right here to keep got, keep keep the invaders off the beach. If there's one place they could have kept them in the water, it was here. But they didn't. Somehow those guys made it happen.